Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Good evening to you. I must tell you, this is a city I always look forward to travelling to on football commentary business, Naples. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. I'm directly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. It's Napoli, and they take on Salernitana. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. And a glance at the Napoli side. Alex Meret is the goalkeeper. Fabian plays with Stanislav Lobotka in the centre of midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack, Dries Mertens. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, as you can see, they're going to play with a front two. And if you do that, it's vital that they work as a pair. They need to play close to each other and combine as much as possible. And now they get the ball rolling. Takes aim. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Lozano. And now Zielinski. Dries Mertens. It's with Irving Lozano. And he takes it away. Obi. Federico Bonazzoli. He has time to play it over. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Dries Mertens couldn't find a teammate throw in here Joel Obi Schiavone they've given it away Lozano, opportunity to deliver the cross, Fabian, Giovanni Di Lorenzo, Lobotka, can he put them in front? There it is, the first goal in the derby, a special moment.
Well, let's look at this again. And what a one to it is to unlock the defence. And from there, he never looked like missing. Well, that's a lovely goal. So underway once more, advantage Napoli here. Mertens. Well, the clearance half-hearted. Mertens. Able to get a body in the way. And played short. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Ball looks promising. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. It comes to nothing in the end. Zielinski. Fabian. And here's Zielinski. Body on the line. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back well just watch this again it's a really good goal but it's no surprise is it they've been in complete control here Second goal for them here. Obi. Francesco Di Tacchio. Now Andrea Schiavone. Oh, good use of the ball. Joel Obi. Well, unable to make anything of the cross. Well, as the stats confirm, Napoli have had the lion's share of the ball and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Mario Rui. He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. There to win it back. Well, approaching half time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, they've played some really good football up to now. In particular, the way they've got it into their front players has been excellent. I've also liked the movement of the strikers. They just now need to take this forward into the second half. Will he play it in? Mario Rui. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. He plays it short. Juan Jesus. And now Zielinski. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. 
And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. Short corner it is. Lobotka. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Federico Bonazzoli. It's with Norbert Jumbert. The first half here comes to an end. Well, Dries Mertens, with his wonderful running and dribbling ability, really excelling, Stuart. Yeah, he's certainly carved out plenty of chances. He's tested the keeper on numerous occasions, and he got his reward with that goal. Brilliant stuff from him. Back in business here, and the Partenope very much bossing it in the first 45. Mario Rui. Mario prevented it from going over the line. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge, and it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. Well, to be honest, I'm not sure what possessed him to put in a challenge like that in the first place. Well, it's dangerous, it's reckless, it's out of control, it's a red card all day long. And time for the change now. He was trying with that free kick, but the goalkeeper had it covered all the way. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Zielinski. It might be. And still danger here. But offside is the decision here. The flag is up. We can get more details on that injury situation from our man pitch side, Jeff Shreves. Jeff? Nasty landing on the shoulder for him there, and he's in real discomfort. He's a tough boy, I think he'll stay on. Cheers, Jeff. Well, mopping up defensively. Lozano. Well, he strayed offside just as it looked promising. Time for a change then. Francesco Di Tacchio. Now oh, moving the ball impressively here. Ditacchio. And they need to get tighter, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Demet. 
Fabian. Can they convert? Just a matter of thumping it away. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Francesco Di Tacchio. He's taken on his opponent here. Oh, excellent diving stop. Juan Jesus on the ball, Demet Zielinski pulls it back and given the defender's touch the referee says corner It's a short one. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And he clears the danger. Good looking ball. And Fabian putting his body on the line. The referee spotted the infringement. And it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. the wall and that'll be the goalkeeper's ball well the minutes are ticking away and Napoli in cruise control here Stuart well I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams for most of the game they've dictated the play and they've created some really good chances I think it's been an excellent performance decided to make a change now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one Giovanni Di Lorenzo The ball with Petania. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Could be! Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. And over it comes. It might still be problematic. Zielinski. And that will be a corner. favoured a short one here 
Jenny. Is this the moment? Jenny. Well, mopping up defensively. A really sumptuous ball. And there it is. That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. without reply and a big chunk of added time here a minimum of five minutes Schiavone Bonazzoli now Andrea Schiavone and a good looking ball the importance of that tackle cannot be overstated Deme. That will do it. The referee blows the whistle and maximum points for Napoli. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?